A lot of times we get stuff in life when we're not in the mindset to appreciate it. You know how many times that we meet people from, you know, they could be a good mate and we could be happy with and have a peaceful, fun-filled, helpful, trustworthy, reliable relationship, but we think we can do better. Oh, I can get somebody to look better than that. I can get somebody with more money than that. I can get somebody with a better body. I can get somebody that's going, you know what I'm saying? We always, not saying you're supposed to settle, but sometimes you have to weigh things out because nobody perfect. And you get with somebody who don't have the flaw that they have, but they end up getting with somebody who have a bigger flaw. I think a problem is, the problem is a lot of people don't know how to weigh flaws. A lot of people don't know minor flaws with big flaws and they don't know that people can do flaws for different reasons. Everybody make a mistake. Just cause somebody lied to you, nobody's perfect. It's nothing perfect about your personality. You may think you're perfect, but you may not be perfect because you may not have a sense of humor. You may not be down to earth. You may not can dance. It's a lot of stuff about your personality. You may be stubborn or you may be controlling to, to an extent that you don't, you're not aware of. You may not lie, you may not steal, but you may be controlling. You may be uh, doubtful. You have other flaws. Just because somebody have a minor flaw, is it, if, if it don't, if it don't have nothing to do with your health, you know, uh, and then when somebody make a mistake, you might want to ask them, "Why did you? What made you lie?" Because a lot of people lie, small lies, out of fear, and as long as that lie don't have nothing to do with lying, is bad either way. But people do stuff for a reason. A kid may lie because they don't want to get in trouble. You know what I'm saying? People ain't lying just a lot. People lying because they don't want to deal with what comes with telling the truth sometimes. It may not have to do with nothing they stole or nothing like that. They might lie because I don't want to have this conversation. I don't want to keep going. You know what I'm saying? Let me just say I, you know, whatever. Let me, you know what I mean? So you got to understand that um, in this world, nobody perfect. And every time you think somebody... The people who you think are perfect got the most flaws. They got major flaws. The people who you think is perfect got the biggest flaws in the world. That's why God always reward the humble. People who say, man, I, hey man, I, I, you know what I'm saying? I cheated, man. It's, hey babe, I cheated, man. You can leave me if you want, but I cheated, man. I was, I just, you know, I couldn't resist that girl body. I, I felt weak. I love you, but if you leave, I can understand. She's going to say, wow. Yes, uh, I love you even more. The fact that you came like clean like that. I mean, I'm just anything. Or you say, babe, I, I, I lied because I, you know, I lied because I was, I ain't want to lose you. I ain't, you know what I'm saying? Oh, babe, don't, you, don't worry about it. You can tell me the truth. You can make small mistakes. I'm not going to leave you. The next time, just, just, just tell me because. I'm not gonna leave you for nothing small like that. You ain't, it's not fatal, I love you, you're not perfect, but you. I know you have a good heart. That's somebody who loves you, but if you're dealing with petty person, if you got a petty mate, you know what I'm saying? You got a petty mate, and they and they want you to be walking on the clouds, and you can't make a mistake. You don't wanna be around nobody who can't make, you, well you can't make a small minor mistake. You don't want a friend like that. You don't wanna be around family members like that. You don't wanna be around a mate like that. But you can't even make a small mistake. You know what I'm saying? You don't want to. You don't want to be around nothing like that, man. You know, a lot of times we're around people that uh, you know, that really they control it. You know, and they dealing with you out of fear. They don't love you. They just dealing with you out of fear because uh, because they think they can control you. And some people think they can control you, but they can't control you. You know what I'm saying? So we got a lot of different, it's a lot of different situations. It's a lot of different situations out there. You know what I'm saying? A lot of different circumstances. It's a lot of different circumstances and situations. You know, you just gotta weigh it out and see what situation you in. Do you have a, are you dealing with a good person? Are you dealing with a good person? You know, that just make small mistakes. Are you dealing with a good person that makes small mistakes? Because you're going to get with a perfect person that got 
major mistakes. Some people are suicidal. Some people, um, you know, they they cheat. A lot. They cheating a lot and no protection. You know what I'm saying? They, you gotta ask yourself. What type of, you know, what type of flaws you dealing with? Are you dealing with somebody that's dealing with substances? Are they taking substances? Are they struggling and wrestling substances? You know, a lot of times we get with people that we comfortable with. Just because you're comfortable around somebody don't mean they're good for you. Just because you're comfortable around somebody don't mean that they're good for you. Sometimes the best people to be around is um, the people that's kind of, um, you're uncomfortable around not because of something they're doing to you but because their mindset is different he said this i'm uncomfortable around this person because they make me they make me better than what i am they're not they're not nitpicking but their presence alone but the way they live their life their presence alone is making you uh it's making you upgrade you you you're, it's an upgrade and they're not even telling you to upgrade it's just the fact that they're around you and you question yourself why is this person, this advanced person, well, this person that's more advanced than me in a lot of things, why are they hanging around me? Well, they might love you for, for your heart. Wow, look at all them birds. They might love you for your heart or they might see some potential in you, you know what I'm saying? You ain't, some people don't get with people just because they already on top of a mountain. Some people get with people because you're gonna be an eagle. You're not even gonna be on top of the mountain. You're gonna be flying above the mountain. So they can see that potential in you. You don't want to get with people that always. You don't want to get with people that always. Uh, all them birds doing, man. You gotta pay attention to nature. Them animals be telling you stuff. They are aware of stuff about the planet quicker than humans, because because <clears throat> humans not in sync. Because humans not in sync. But it's all about uh, it's all about staying prayed up, man. You know, it's a, a lot of times we miss out on stuff, man. You get a, you know, a lot of guys miss out on good women early on in life because you're young and the girl young, and you think everybody gonna be young forever. So you don't, you think, you know, you just not in a mindset to say, I got a good person, let me stick with him. You thinking like, man, I wanna. I want to smash this girl, I want to smash this girl, I want to smash her. I want to smash this nationality, this nationality I want to do. Short girl, tall girl, you want, so you, you trying to try all this different stuff out. And then next thing you know, you like, tag, man. Then you get older, you get all this money. You be like, tag, all the women, they, they cool, but they seem to be asking me for my money. Why they want my money? Why they always ask me what I do for a living? They, they ain't used to ask me this when I was little. Dang, they, so, they, they, they superficial now and then I got older. They, they require more of me and they don't really like me for me. And they stuff don't feel the same. It's loose, it's not. They're, they're getting, they, they dating all these guys and all these people from other countries. They travel around the world. They, they letting all these people smash them from all these other countries. Uh, they expect so much out of a man and they, you know, and all they gotta bring is their, their looks and their buyami. You know what's going on you know like why i should have stayed with some of the girls in high school i should stay with a girl in high school or, or at least got some babies by them in high school or something because they was more genuine but times change you know you got social media you know the value of 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 uh of smashing them, them that became higher it's not about love no more it's about lust you know what i'm saying some nosy people just get away these people so nosy man just so nosy you didn't have to come this way they just <laughs> people off the chain but that's the type of reality we live in y'all man so you just got to stay prayed up all this stuff is the fruits of the devil all this stuff is the fruits of the devil man so stay prayed up i'm alan ray in there man Don't, if you like the video just share this video link to your facebook page and uh follow me on facebook too to the links are in the description box. Follow me on Facebook, bro. Right? And the links are in the description box. And uh, press like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Uh, follow me on Instagram, too, at Alan Rillionaire Show. Uh, Alan Rillionaire Show is the Instagram. 
we can do a consultation uh we can do a consultation or we can do a um i can give you some health tips that work good for me and relationship tips so hit me up on instagram at alan ray that show and much love to you stay prayed up in jesus name it's all everything is all about god man help somebody because if you don't help nobody god ain't gonna um don't just help people who gonna help you or who make you feel good help people that you don't know and the bigger you the bigger sacrifice you make for a person or you, that you go out the way for god gonna use that he's he gonna bless you man he'll bless you he'll bless you in situations he'll bless you in your health you know he'll bless you in your happiness he'll bless you with your safety so it's different forms of blessings man you know what i mean it's different forms of blessings but i'm alan ray and much love to you stay prayed up i'm out